Springfield's Morning News. I'm Greg Bishop on 92.7 WMAY. Springfield's News and Talk. Love telling you about events in the area, how you can help our communities. And coming up, we've gotten events from Waverly Schools. And joining us in studio is Dr. Andrea Guerrero, the superintendent of Waverly Schools, and Sam Hamra. Uh, thanks for taking time with us, guys. And let's talk about the Waverly Classic for 2022. Uh, this is the first year. Correct. This is our first year. All right. So tell us all about it. What can people expect? Yeah. So um, the golf outing itself is on August 7th. And I'll let Sam, he's our technology director, um, speak on this. He's also um, one of the co-chairs for the committee, um, the Waverly Golf Classic Committee. Um, really the purpose behind us hosting this golf classic is although we've received um, tremendous amount of funds, we were issued um, a wellness grant, some technology grants, um, as well as we did have our that ESSER money. It came can't be used for things like field trips. Um, oftentimes, um, some of the supplies that teachers need, not student supplies, but teachers need, um, those grants don't cover those materials. Even if we wanted to do something fun, um, like a luncheon for our teachers, um, that's not covered by grants. Um, also, additional food and snacks for students isn't always covered um, in those costs. And so our teachers will take the funds that we raise. Um, they will then um, submit a proposal to the golf committee and the administrators, and we will um, be able to equitably um, distribute the funds that are raised. So we just there's an accountability piece on our end um, as as administrators and hosting the golf tournament, um, as well as some of the fun that goes with it that day. And Sam can share um, some of the fun from that they have um, planned. Yeah, so Sam, classic. of course, golf outings, very popular. Uh, it's just a time for people to get together and to, to help out a common cause. It being Waverly Schools, what can people expect? Uh, yeah, yeah, we're super excited. So we've got uh, one of the sponsors is going to sponsor a $10,000 hole-in-one. Oh, wow. uh, so we're really excited about Whoa! that. <laughs> Whoa! All right, hold on. $10,000 for a hole-in-one? $10,000, yeah, yeah. So we're very Who's excited. Who's the sponsor on that? That's uh, huge. I can't name it yet. Everything's oh still got to be signed and inked so uh, but it, it, it is in place and we're very excited to have well, it. well we're so gonna we hold them accountable far. all right yeah. so uh, yeah. yeah it's uh, that's a big deal um and of course uh, this is just one of many things that people are going to experience at a golf outing mm -hmm. yeah yes. yeah absolutely uh the the coach from jacksonville uh S illinois college illinois college thank you <laughs> um she is going to come out she's actually a pga pro uh so we're going to do another hole that's uh hit with the pro um so you you pay her a fee and uh, she'll hit with you, and since she is a female at the outing, she'll get to tee up on the uh, the, the front box. So uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. We've got drivers, putters. Uh, we've got hundreds of dollars of gift cards to give away. Uh, Edgewood Golf Course is where it's going to be hosted at on the 7th. Uh, it's a 9 a.m. registration, um, check-in, I should say, and 10 a.m. Uh, shotgun start. So there will be some breakfast in the morning, and then 3 o'clock we'll have some uh early dinner and late lunch, if you will. And two of our largest sponsors are Grand Canyon University. They'll also be there to discuss our community partnership. Um, so um, we're fortunate in that any student who um, attends our school, um, their parents can attend Grand Canyon on a 10% scholarship for tuition, um, as well as there's some benefits for our staff there. So they're going to talk about that partnership that we have in our community and how to expand that. Um, we also have Valentine Construction, um, who's sponsored um, about half a dozen holes um, for us as well, who will be out there. That's great. It's the mm -hmm. 2022 Waverly Classic. It's going to be at Edgewood Golf Course August 7th. So plenty of time between now and then for you to get that on your calendar and get, uh, get a uh, team together. Uh, how much is it per person? Uh, so the fee per person is 85, um, and we would like registrations as early as possible so that we can get food reservations in for you. Yeah, that's going to be important because uh, after uh, you know several rounds of golf, you definitely need to, to get some food to keep you going there. Uh, so how can people register for this? Mm -hmm. Uh, two different ways. Um, they can, uh, if they see the flyer around, they can send that in to us. Uh, they can also call our office at 217-435-8121. Um, and then they can mail anything in to 201 North Miller in Waverly, Illinois, and that's 62692. And, of course, we have information on our website, which is wsd6.org. 
um, and it has more information and details about the um, Best Ball um, Golf Classic, and it's $85. That does include lunch, dinner, and three beverages um, that will be provided throughout the day. So again, it's the 2022 Waverly Classic, August 7th at Edgewood Golf Course. Be sure to get it on your calendar, 85 bucks per person. Are you guys still seeking uh, hole sponsorships? Absolutely. Of, of course, it's $100 to sponsor a hole. All right. Uh, so this is a, obviously something that's going to help out the Waverly community. As you heard uh, the superintendent, Dr. Andrea Guerrero, talk about, uh, they do have those federal uh, COVID relief dollars, but they can't use that for everything. Uh, so they still need to be able to raise some funds for a variety of things. Andrea, uh, again, break out just some of the things that this is going to help fund. So field trips, um, transportation cost of field trips, um, as well as um, if we do a luncheon for our teachers, when we do those, typically that comes out of my pocket or um, if I can find someone in the community community to help, um, as well as it will help us um, with materials that teachers need um, that go outside the scope of the funds um, for their classrooms um, and for students and incentives for students um, for behavior rewards, um, for academic awards, things like that um, just can't be purchased with federal dollars. So a lot of uh, important things to help fund with the Waverly Schools, and you can do that by taking part in the 2022 Waverly Classic, August 7th at Edgewood Golf Course. Uh, Again, uh, Sam Hamra, Dr. Andrea Guerrero, thank you for, for taking time. Sam, uh, give us the website again one more time. People can go check this out. It is WSD6.org. All right. So make that happen and get out there August 7th. Waverly Classic at Edgewood Golf Course. Greatly appreciate you both of you taking time with us today. And thank, thank you. you. Sir. It is Springfield's Morning News. I'm Greg Bishop on 92.7 WMAY, Springfield's News and Talk.